before you order that battery, make sure that you're looking at the options on the vehicle and even the VIN number. We're gonna find out why next. This video is sponsored by Auto Value and Bumper to Bumper. Visit us online for more information. When you're ordering a battery for a vehicle, it is critical that you look at more than just the BCI size and where the posts are on it. It is critical that you look at the vehicle. What engine is in it? What's the engine code? What options are on the vehicle? These are going to impact the battery selection for the vehicle. And the two things that's gonna impact, cold cranking amps and reserve capacity. For example, you may have two Hyundai Elantras in your shop. One may have the ISG system or their stop-start system. This one is going to require a battery with probably more than 750 cold cranking amps, while the normal vehicle may only need 550. Also, the reserve capacity is going to matter. Typically, a battery for a stop-start system is going to be at least 25-30% to 30 more than a normal battery. Also, look at the battery type the manufacturer specifies. On some vehicles, it's going to be an AGM battery or aggregated glass mat. On other ones that may not have a stop-start system, a flooded battery is going to do just fine. So make sure that you look at the vehicle, the battery catalog, and the cold cranking amps that are on the label for the battery so you pick the right battery for the vehicle and the customer. I'm Andrew Markell. Thank you very much. <music>